let's create our new cosmic white beard in anime champion simulator make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and like the video for free bow bugs yo what up f minus gang gang back here again on anime champion simulator y'all i have been farming for so damn long in this update oh my god it's literally been like two days since the updates and we pulled one godfather summon yes sir we have done it it only took two days which is crazy that was oh my god like what the what is the rates on this thing and i have like a hundred luck so my biggest advice to you if you want to pull white beard which is the godfather summon maximize your luck in the game or just buy it from the season pass do your daily tasks i think you get it for free if you do the diamond pass you can get diamonds in the game for free at level 20 right there could take a couple days maybe a week but you guys will eventually get it and what i did was just spin on the marine orb over here we're about to unlock the strongest new unit in the game and i am so excited for it i've shown you guys before my strongest unit currently i think it's levi actually his average dps is 861 billion without any skins he's already max level 150 his talent is maxed out at 150 this dude is killing it ascension 3 plus he has titan plus he has black hole here's the cosmic summons here is the Godfather summon. I've heard, yep, and I heard right. You can only get Whitebeard. So I guess when the new world comes out, maybe this weekend or next weekend, you'll eventually be able to open up new Cosmics, whatever the new maps are. Don't know, maybe Seven Deadly Sins, Black Clover. For right now, it's just Whitebeard. That's perfect for us. I do want to check out his base damage. I want to see how much higher it is than, let's say, Levi. Levi at level 1 is 268. Well, we have the mythical unit here. Phoenix 168. The mythical from the last map over here at Atlanta Giants 132. We're already seeing like a 30% maybe damage bonus, 30-ish, maybe 20-30%. So I'm guessing Whitebeard's about 20-30% stronger than Levi. Could be even higher depending if we get a godly unit. Yes, sir. Come on, big money direct. Big Daddy Direv, Big D, help F minus out. Let's get three shooting star. Ooh, we did not get a godly, but that's okay. You guys know how to tell if we do get a godly. There it is. We got Big Man White Beard. And you know what? That's okay. White Mustache is still amazing. Quick for user. You know why? Because we got the cosmic skin. We can maximize his talent for the video. We can max level him. We can't first ascend him, but by the time you're watching this video, he's probably already triple ascended. And I can reroll the quirk. I don't know if I showed you this earlier. If I go to my backpack, I have 2,000 and like 100 execution medals. We did a bunch of nightmare raids. So if you join F minus, you open the purple chest, you can get like 2000 medals. You guys can also reroll your white beard or maybe you're down bad, you can't get white beard. You guys can also reroll any other units in the newest map like Phoenix, Blaze, Python Empress. You guys wanna do Skelly Bard or Brook, it's up to you guys. What F minus is gonna do is power level our new white mustache over here to the highest possible limits. So you can already see Whitebeard. Uh, for some reason, he's kind of tiny in the game. <laughs> Levi, I mean, Levi's like basically the same height, which is crazy. They should have made him a little bit taller at least. Because Adult Gone is big, it only makes sense. Whitebeard is also big. Like, what is this? Why is Adult Gone bigger than Whitebeard? I don't know. I didn't make this game. Hey, they said let the devs cook. Let them cook. Okay. And then the update was delayed. <laughs> First thing is first, let's use the talent machine. Talent machine is gonna help us out because we get better talent. Jeez, look at the attack speed, 99. Woo, we're gonna try to go for 100 on the damage and then critical damage, ability damage, something around 90 or higher. That is the goal if we can reach it. Now we do have a bunch of talent tokens. It's definitely possible. We're gonna definitely try our best ability damage, 89. No, we're only gonna go for S, only S. Um, yeah, not 90. 90's a little too low. Obliquely damage at 94 is not bad. We're gonna keep re-rolling this. We're only using four tokens per. We can roll like at least 100 times or something like that. So it's either the damage is gonna get high or the critical damage is gonna get high. I'm not sure which one's gonna come first. Damn, 97 for damage, two for crit. Let's keep going. Come on, big money right here. Let's get 90 or higher. Finish up our white beer. Critical damage at 91. Hmm. 
you must think f minus is a joke if you think i'm gonna keep that come on 91 ability damage 94 let's keep the ability damage but re-roll the crit damage i feel like we can get higher than 91 come on now of course 94 94 99 for speed 97 for damage the damage could be higher however 29 percent right and we got a triple ascended unit levi here the difference is 46 percent it's like 15 percent extra damage it helps out just a little bit it does it really does now the skin reforger is the next thing with the newest update they did add new affixes apparently there's two um i've only rolled for one of them one of the ones that i rolled for in the update video was warrior apparently there's another one i don't know what it's called but let's see what we get so unstoppable to see okay we got swift ruthless if we end up rolling like perfection or something i already take it because we still have to reroll his quirk and max level him his quirk we're gonna have to go for genius or something so we can max level him fast and we'll use an exp potion because there's still a 4x exp event going on everything is in our favor today and we have a bunch of like scraps we got like almost 10,000. crazy furious 48 percent nope ruthless nope conquest nope let's get that warrior one let's get the warrior one you already know i pulled it before in the update video warrior come on let's see it or if apparently there's another one i that's what somebody else said i don't know if i've seen it though ancient magnus what is this ability damage 75 percent damage 60 percent crit damage 18 percent charge speed 15 percent what the heck <laughs> what is this ability damage 75 percent so if i stack that with sorcerer does that mean our white beard is op hmm i don't know maybe he is maybe he isn't that's why i'm doing the video i don't exactly know all i know is i got ancient magnus young old man sounds pretty cool i wish i could put two of these on white beard but i can't triple ascend them yet so that'd be a different video and i do have another skin here that's like warrior right here warrior wings of care punch damage so i guess it's kind of good white beard has ancient magus young old man or ancient magus affix because it's ability damage if you guys have seen one piece white beard go crazy with that white uh, white qu or that quake fruit <laughs> let's go put white stash in here we do have to try to roll for genius 2 genius 3 let's go for crimson let's also go for boxer titan a celestial black hole <laughs> archmage giants notice how i didn't go for assassin because assassin i feel like it's a little too weak some people were saying assassin got nerfed as well i don't know if that's true damn we already pulled genius 3 damn man this game is a little too easy for f minus i don't know what to tell y'all the game is a little too easy so we are gonna power level him right now what does that mean we gotta take one of this right here wings of care knowledge 30 percent exp boost i put this on white stash temporarily until he gets to level 150 I'm gonna use an EXP boost as well, and who knows, maybe we get lucky in these next like 10 minutes while we're trying to level up our white beard. We get another white beard, another cosmic summon. I, I don't think that'll happen, but you never know, it's possible. I'm gonna go to our config. Let's go select our white beard. I think his name in the game is like White Stash. I might have to change the name, by the way. And then we're gonna fuse everything to him. We're just gonna open up. You guys can see in real time his leveling speed. Jesus. He went from 110 to 130, 130 to 133, 133 to 135, 135 to 136, come on, 137, ooh, 138, baby, yes, sir, 139, come on, 140, 140, 140, almost 140. It's really easy to level up your units because of 4x EXP. Make sure you guys are taking advantage of the event. By the time you're watching this video, maybe the events are over. I hope you had taken advantage of these events because you could really jack up your DPS. All I really have to do for Whitebeard now after I max level him, because this talent, it's already good to go. I'm gonna leave it like this. I don't need to spend more talent tokens to get 100 because I'm gonna triple ascend him anyways. His quirk. We gotta get a better quirk. How do we get a better quirk? Run Nightmare Raids. Let's see if we get one of the new quirks at that. And the Wings of Care Knowledge, we are gonna replace this with his Cosmic Skin. That gives him ability charge and ability damage. Maybe I stack it with Sorcerer. So whenever he gets his ability off, he's doing like gazillions amounts of damage. Maybe. I don't know if that's how it works. But F- is definitely going to have to take a look at it. Damn, he's already level 146. Ooh, Whitebeard is a contender for max leveling. 
And another thing that I forgot to do, Marin's Fortress Index. Let's see his base damage at level 1, 336. 336 Captain is 268. If I put this in the calculator right now, we can actually see exactly how strong he is. 336 divided by 268. Now that's just raw damage. It doesn't take into account... Actually, I think they fixed it in this update. Every uh, champion's ability is now like at a set time. It's not as number of hits. So I guess Whitebeard putting in the calculator, 25% stronger, exactly 25% stronger than Captain Levi. That means if you guys don't get the Cosmic, but you get Phoenix, 25% stronger than Aaron Jaeger. Probably somewhere in that range. 25% is a lot. If you have a godly unit, that's another 30%. That's like, what, 1.5 times damage if you got a godly white beer. But obviously getting a godly white beer is going to be kind of difficult unless you guys pay Robux. Get the, uh, what is it, the Godfather summons here. There is a bunch of them. You can get one right here, Godfather summon. Maybe you get lucky. You guys let me know in the comments if you got lucky and you got a godly white beard. I'm going to continue to level white wolf. <laughs> oh, jeez. Look at this. Y'all see my mouse cursor? I'm going to leave it right there. You see that line right there when I started talking? Look at that. Every time I fuse like 10 units, it goes up like 10% EXP. I was about to AFK come back in like, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. No, this dude's already done literally in like, I don't know, like three minutes. Absolutely insane. But that's what I'm talking about because all I got to do is switch out the skin now, like I said, and switch the quirk. And it looks like maybe one more max fuse for F minus. And there it is level 150 6 billion damage what the f minus it's so low i know guys it is low especially if you compare it to our levi 861 billion levi doing about 100 times the damage than whitebeard however we are not finished like i said we do have to change the quirk and then we have to change out the skin we change out Maybe the skin, he gets a little bit stronger. And the skin that we have is right here. Ancient Magus, which is, I guess, perfect for White Stash. Let's see how much stronger he gets. Currently, his damage right now, DPS, is 15.5 billion. So he got about three times stronger. But comparing it to Levi, 15.5, 861 billion. It's, dude, what the f That's crazy. We got to get another quirk for our boy over here. This time, we're not going for genius. And I have 2,000 medals. It only costs like 10 medals each time. We are going for Crimson Demon if we can. Boxer. I think that would be weird because doesn't Boxer count, like, cancel out the ability? And I think his skin affix relies on his ability. Yeah, ability damage 75%. So the one we really want to go for for White Stash. So that not he doesn't have the strongest base damage but the strongest ability damage is gonna be archmage or i don't know if there's like sorcerer in this i guess i'm thinking of the wrong game we definitely want to try to get archmage though maybe giants uh a celestial black hole archmage i really want to try to get kim's and demon but if it lands on boxer i'll give him a different skin let's see what we get preferably crimson demon yes maybe crimson demon if it's not crimson demon i'm not gonna be disappointed it's okay i'm gonna keep on spinning though y'all for the next 200 spins or something like that until i run out of metals if i run out of metals we're farming nightmare raids and you guys can farm nightmare raids with me all you gotta do is join my stream damn i don't know what to tell y'all i said i'll see you guys later and then like five rerolls later we already have archmage so archmage plus we stack it with the magus skin you could say he has the strongest ability charge, ability damage now. Maybe not the strongest base damage, but the title does say strongest, and he is strong when it comes to his ability. Now he's pushing 32 build. What the? Why? Why is Levi just... What? 861 billion. Crits 9.17x. What about Whitebeard? Whitebeard's the same, isn't he? Let's go take a look at it. Crits is 1.44. Why is Levi so much higher? Is it because of Black Hole and Titan? Is it that weak? Archmage and Magus? Oh my god. I know guaranteed his ability might be stronger than Levi's. But damn, 32 bill, 861 bill. Levi's about 25, 
20 times stronger than Whitebeard. Whitebeard is not triple ascended, but I mean, all we're doing is adding another quirk, another skin. Maybe if I triple ascended Whitebeard and then also the first ascension is like almost like 50% damage, it would be enough to catch up to Levi. But right now we can go ahead and equip our White Stash. Yo, White Stash in the building. And then we can test out his damage on the straw dummy. I'm going to turn on the auto clicker as well. And then you can see white stash over here or white mustache. Dang. Prime Whitebeard looking kind of looking kind of angry. And you can see his like new quirk at the bottom. I don't know if that's like Archmage or if that's his skin affix. I don't think I really care. <laughs> Let's just start attacking. So it looks like it's going to be about two hits, three. Oh, it's not based on hits. It's based on how long it takes to charge his ability up. So when he gets his ability off, if it's a critical, you see at like 12 billion, can we get to like 100 billion when his ability gets off? Come on, yes. Uh... <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh my goodness, it went negative? Bro! I don't know about Whitebeard's ability, or maybe I'm doing it wrong, but when his ability got off, I don't know. I didn't see anything change with the, the dummy over here. It went to negative DPS. I don't know if that's a good thing or bad thing. I mean, I can bring him on the newest map, try to verse Akanu and see how that goes. Quake Fruit versus Magma Fruit. Let's go see his ability one more time, though. You guys will see him get it off. Look at it. It goes down. 8 bill, 6 bill. It's going down. 5 bill, 4 bill, 3 bill. It's going down. Hurry up and attack this dude. Oh my lord. You're supposed to have the strongest ability. Come on. His tsunami went negative, bro. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that. Let's go to Galaxy 2. Maybe it's glitched, right? Or maybe just Whitebeard is just trashed. But you know what? I don't think he is. I believe. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a really powerful and really strong boss. Like I said, in the very back, in the middle of the map, we do have Akano over here. I don't know if that's how you pronounce his name, but he is the Magma Fruit user. Let's go start attacking him. Someone's already attacking him. Uh, let's go find another boss. All right. We got the Storm Merchant here. I'm going to turn off Auto Clicker. We're just going to 1v1 this. So we got White Beard. Oh, my Jesus. What the? Go get him, White Beard. Yeah. Knock him down. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, all access pass. Okay, so he did a tsunami attack and he's trash. <laughs> I'm sorry, he's trash. Look at it. 4.5 trillion. Bro didn't do anything. You know what? Maybe it's a fluke. I'll turn on auto clicker and we'll see. We'll let him get his ability off one more time because I can whip out Levi right now. And I promise you, Levi is going to destroy the Storm Marshal so much faster. And it's not even going to be close. Here it is. Whitebeard with his ability one more time. Come on, take that HP down to zero. 4.06. 4 trillion HP. Come on. Yes, sir. Come on. Uh, come on. Get it, get it, get it with the Tsunami. Yeah. Oh, God. He's trash. He's trash. <laughs> He's so flashy, but he's trash. Unless I'm doing something wrong. You guys got to let me know in the comments. Let me show you what Levi can do, though. Levi right here, he didn't even have any skins equipped. And did he just... <laughs> he already killed him. Okay, so here's Levi once again with auto clicker. Look at that. Look at that. Levi already just hitting him like two times. That's the Celestial. That's that Titan going... Or Black Hole and Titan going at it. Jeez. Look at the Storm Marshal. He's already dead. Bro, what is what is wrong with my white beard? <laughs> Y'all gotta help me out in the comments. Hopefully you enjoyed the video though. He's gonna be Ascension 3 by the time you're watching this. So it's good enough. Really do appreciate your guys' support. And until next time, guys, I'll see you in the next video.